Welcome guys, this is Edwin and today we have a comparison video between these two Tiger models right here. This is a request by a brother in the community that is looking at the Tiger and he asked me if I could do this type of comparison. Of, of course, man, no problem. I love talking knives, so let's go for it. On top, we have a custom by Ernest Emerson, okay, Tiger model. And when we are talking about a custom, we're talking about a knife that was handmade hand ground contour by Ernest Emerson himself. These knives are in limited fashion, right? This knife can only be obtained through auctions, lotos, or, you know, secondary market. At the bottom, we have a production knife by Emerson Knives, right? Emerson Knives USA. And this knife is more readily available. It's a knife you can buy and obtain through their website and you know and get it this week if you want right so so be aware of that that's one of the main difference right there now in terms of the knives okay they both run in washers they're the same model so for the most part they have the same specs and the specs are 3.8 inches and overall 9 inches they're both running on washers they both will have the wave and the similar spec like I mentioned, and they both have liners. But one thing to notice is that in the custom, the liners are way thicker there, okay? And again, you know, the lockup in my production knives are great, so no problem with that, but it's one of those differences, okay? In the production knife of the Tiger, right, those handles are G10, they are very well contoured in the borders, you know, this side here is well contoured and the ergonomics are excellent, okay? I love the ergonomics of the Tiger, it's one of my favorite models. I just love the shape of this uh, piece right here, okay? So great ergonomics on the G10, the G10 is very aggressive, uh, but other than that, you know, it's one of those that the ergonomics are just perfect for my hand. In this case, we have a satin blade, and I love this V grind on the on the tiger. So it's you know grind on both sides, and then you have that chisel edge right there. Okay, so that's regarding the production knife. Another thing from the production knife is that this is a modern one, so you will notice that it's running on standoffs right there. Okay, like you can see. And most of the modern productions are doing that. And they both will have that Benchmade clip. Now, one difference between the custom and the production is the handle, how contour that handle is, right? In this custom one, you can see how Ernest contoured those handles perfectly, okay? Of course, this one is G10, it's more flat, right, in the production. And you can even see that it's a little bit, it looks even a little bit, uh, how you say, uh, taller in the production compared to the custom. Okay, and one of the things is that contouring on the handle in the custom is just excellent, guys. It feels like a, like a fixed blade, that handle right there. It's all contour. It's all handmade, right? So, so you will notice that it's handmade, so it's not 100% perfect, right? You will see it's a little bit thinner here than there, but that contouring on this whole construction in the custom is spot on for the Tiger, okay? It's just excellent. And that's one of the main difference between a custom and a production. Also, that blade, like I show you the the cost the production one, this custom right have that Emerson Specware knife is hand ground by Ernest Emerson, and you know it's hand ground, so the swatch is a little bit different than your production, and you have that signature grind lines in this V grind that Ernest Emerson is famous for, and it's just sick, you know, it's just badass. I love it. It's just stunning. And in this case, it's a V grind with that beautiful chisel edge that is super sharp right there. And that finish in the blade is also different in the customs. You know, that finish that they do right there is quite different there as well. Okay. 
So let me show you real quick what I mean by that finish. Okay, you have like that stone watch right here in the production and in here is more of a satin finish or so, okay? But again, guys, you know, you can see how that switch in the production is different than in this custom, right? And one of the things with the customs is that, you know, from custom to custom, they will be different, right? Because all this is handmade, hand contour, and you will have differences in how he's shaping those handles or if he want to put a, a switch on it or not, right? And things like that. For example, you can see this handle here, how that, how that butt there is more spiky here compared to this one, it's more rounded and little things like that. And the other thing in that bolster, you see this relief here to be able to access that lock that is not available in the production, but you know, little details like that. So. So yeah, this is just a quick comparison, you know, is both knives will get the job done. I love both knives, you know, I own both of them. So, so the Tiger is a great model. And if you get the custom or the production, I think it doesn't matter. You're making a great choice for that. Okay. For this model. So guys, that's all I got. So again, thank you for watching. If you have any question, feel free to comment on Instagram, the YouTube comments, or in the Facebook groups, right? Emerson Operators, ECOG, or of course, USN Forums, that we're always there talking knives and having a great time, okay? Thank you for watching, guys. Bye.